Hi campers, it's Miss Yaz from Camp Quarantine. Today's art lesson is brought to you by Yayoi Kusama. And today we are trying to make a sculpture, our last sculpture for the week. And we are trying to make a white room so that we can obliterate it with a shape of our choice. Obliterate means to cover, to just, it's almost like an explosion, okay? of a certain shape. So yeah, you all love spots. So when I went to her um, art show to see the obliteration room, we were allowed to put stickers all over the room. So much so that the room was covered in spots, okay? So today you're allowed to choose any shape that you want, so long as it's the same shape, but first we need a um, an obliteration room to start with that's white. So what I've got is a box, um, and what you need to do is get some white paper and just make the box white, okay? So cover your inside of your box with white paper with just stickers. So here we have our box with um, that's white. Then we actually need some furniture, okay? So with our furniture, I've got a shelf here. I've got some chairs. A table and this is all just with white paper and another chair and then what we're gonna do is we need something oh they're all falling down we need something so that we can paint draw or stick one certain shape all over the room to create the obliteration room so this shortcut is to show you how to make a chair and I'm hoping when you learn how to make a chair you could make a table and some shelves, and you can even do lamps and frames. It's up to you. So what I've got here is just some white paper, and I've cut four little rectangles and folded them in half. So there's my rectangle one, two, three, four, and I've folded them in half. These are gonna be the legs of our chair, okay? I've got them four times. I've also got a square here, and what I've done is I've just folded each side in, like that, can you see that? Then open it up and the corners, I'm just going to poke inside. See that? Poke them inside. Okay. That one was easy. Yeah. Mm. Then poke that one inside and poke that one inside. So now we have the seat of our chair. We're going to get out the legs and put a little bit of glue on the end, just on the end there, and put it on the uh, outside or inside, it doesn't really matter, of your chair. Can you hear my babies out there? Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, there we go. Could use sticky tape as well, actually. That might be a bit quicker. We're gonna stick it on like that. Do you see? Okay. So what we're gonna do is do all three legs. So then you've got three legs that are on like that, okay? Then you've got the back of your chair. We're gonna just stick it on like this. I've just cut a rectangle, like the letter A. Okay, and we're gonna stick it on like this. And then that will have the legs of your chair. So it will look like this. Do you understand that? So, have a play. There is no right way to do this, but all we want to do is make white furniture so we can cover it in, I'm going to choose stars. You could paint it with spots. You could stick all sorts of stickers to it, but cover your furniture and the room that you made, the pretend room, with stickers. All right. Have fun making your obliteration room sculpture. Bye.